hope you watch it at home. And WA on Fire fans, I'm Tommy Hunter, and on the show this week, you will see in action from the Body Slam Wrestling Organization, Dragon Blaze, as he takes on Showtime, Sean Sheridan. Richie Rotten and Preacher look to take each other apart. A classic match featuring Black Jack Mulligan and Billy Graham, and our main event fans, Seven Foot One, Giant Pharaoh meets Magic. It all happens this week on the program, fans. Don't go away. Now here comes Showtime. Sean Sheridan, the BWO's resident video game nerd. And of course, in that bag, we all know what's in there. It's that infamous power glove. Has he ever heard of the Xbox 360, just out of curiosity, you think? I don't think he has. I believe he's old school Nintendo all the way. This man, the master of the Nintendo video game, he loves playing Paperboy. He loves playing a sight bike for the Nintendo. It's like 1985 never, never ended for him, right? Exactly. Bowling for Chiefs were singing for him. Regardless of that, though, Showtime Sean Sheridan has about one thing. He's about winning matches. The master of the neck breaker. He's done quite the role as of late. Absolutely. There's no denying that, John. You remember a long time ago, Sean Sheridan on quite the losing streak. Yep. But he's definitely redeemed himself lately, though. Yes, he has. Now... Now the video game expert ready to get underway. There's one thing about Sean Sheridan. He wants revenge on Draven Blaze in the worst possible way, Hunter. It was several months ago in the battle between Nintendo and Sega. Yeah. Where in a mask versus career match, Sean Sheridan unmasked Sagan. Unbelievably, it was the, the former BWO champion, Draven Blaze. And Draven's been definitely on the comeback trail here as of late again. You know, we haven't seen him since. He's trying to rebound, make a new name for himself, trying to regain some of his bearings. Mm -hmm. And so far, he's been doing it. And oh, now look at Sheridan, he was trying to grab him outside of the ring still. And now Sheridan wants his revenge on Draven Blaze in the worst possible way. And it's going to happen right now, actually. Absolutely, Hunter. Here we go. And Draven Blaze has always been a technical wrestler. And now Sean Sheridan is as well, okay? They're both technical, uh, but I think Draven Blaze is just, just has a little bit over an edge, in my opinion. That's just me talking. You know, that's your opinion, that's mine. But in my opinion, the man to watch out for is Sean Sheridan. Sheridan is a couple big wins away from going to the next tier here in Wrestling on Fire. One, two, three, boom! He just said boom. Yeah. Well, here we go. This match is getting wow. hot and heavy right now. Oh, <laughs> Draven saw him coming, too, and he says, you're not going to get in over like that with me. No Pearl Har Harbor job with me, dude. Well, just oh, knowing that Draven Blaze was under a mask, wrestling Sean Sheridan for several months in the early part of 2011, needs to say he must know everything about Sean Sheridan inside the wrestling circle. Wow! What a nice jump and kick that was, John. Two and, oh, only a two count. Oh, comedy antics, antics from Draven Blaze right now. Sean Sheridan being taken apart by Draven Blaze, who's a very innovative wrestler when he wants to be. When he's not, he is not on his game, he will definitely lose. And that's one thing about Draven Blaze. He's either hot or cold. Right now, he's looking very hot. <laughs> Look at that noogie he gave him. <laughs> he's got him in such a good headlock. He says, let me throw a little noogie in there as well, huh? Tried to push him off. No, but Draven back, back to that side headlock once again. Wow, nice chain wrestling there, John. Oh, ends up at the same place he left off. 
Side note, fans chanting for the Noogie. <laughs> there it goes again. Noogie Patrol. <laughs> Sheridan again bouncing to the corner for the second time, trying to get to have Draven Blaze release the side headlock, but he's not abiding. Clean break, you think, John? What do you want to bet? It's Sean Sheridan. What I'm do you want sure to bet? Anything. Oh, nah. Sheridan goes right to the eyes. I knew that was going to happen. And then just raking that back. Sean Sheridan is such a good wrestler when he feels like it, but he takes these shortcuts all the time, and personally, I just don't know why he has to do that. What well, about Sean Sheridan, though, Hunter? He likes to work on the neck. He is mm -hmm. the master of the neck breaker. He is definitely softening that neck up, and not by top rope. That's going to help matters much. And again, Sheridan's just that type of guy. He needs one or two big wins to get to that next in. level. And there's a springboard blockbuster. While Blaze was on the ground, sitting in position, cover. Only two from referee Anthony D'Amato. Gonna take more than that to put Draven Blaze down. Sheridan has to keep on the advantage. Though we know Sheridan, whenever he gets a big advantage, he likes to take his time and jaw jack with the crowd. He cannot take that opportunity. And there's Hydukin right to the midsection. And a running uppercut. Sheridan should have gone for the cover there. He had him. Going up to that second, second turnbuckle now. He's just waiting on Draven. Could be a mistake, though. Draven could be regaining his bearings for all you know. No. Very nice. Mortal Kombat kick. There's a cover. And very video game-like on the cover attempt. Only two. Did you expect him to do anything else except like a video game? I don't know. Sean Sheridan really loves basing himself off of video game nature. I wonder if he's ever heard of the Wii Fit. Oh, I doubt it. Irish whip, no reversal. Blaze bouncing him off. Looking for a hip toss. No, Sheridan with a nice counter. Looking for a neck breaker. Blaze saw it coming. Wow. Off the ropes. Nice. Planted that, I believe, right in the nose he got that one. Blaze with a big kick to the face of the cartwheel. See how he's holding his nose? I think he almost broke that. Well, if you remember a few months ago, Blaze, when he had the mask on, actually broke the nose of Sean Sheridan. Yeah, he, he did. Going right back to the weak point of the nasal Oh, cavity. look at this. Wait a second. Trying to get that Kata Jamey in. Yes, that is his coup de grace. Oh! A nice Union Jack neck breaker there from Sheridan. Only two. Blaze went for that Kata Jamey. That judo choke. An illegal hold in judo, but legal in the wrestling ring. He went for a Sheridan counter neck breaker, and now he's wasting too much time. I that. agree, John. He has Graven down. He should stay right on top of him. He's not. Right now, though, Sheridan looking to pick him up. Blazer looking for that one of his moves here. Oh! oh dropped him face first in that top turnbuckle. Now he's just draped on that second one. Come on, ref. Get him out of there. Nice innovative use of a neck breaker was Sheridan there. Now Sheridan is really just trying to disrespect Blaze all the months of torture with Nintendo versus Sega. Now put right to the side of the face. That size 11 wrestling shoe right into the mush. And Sheridan, the referee D'Amato talking trash here. More Sheridan talking trash. Not a smart idea though because Draven Blaze is now regaining his senses a little bit and getting up. I don't know, he Sheridan, picked him up though, he, he saw, saw it, it coming. coming. And then, off the rope, no, wait a second. Whoa! Another neck breaker. Oh, foot on the rope, I think it's the only thing that may have saved Draven Blaze from getting pinned there. I didn't think Blaze had an opportunity to get that foot on the rope, but somehow the, the long limbs of Blaze stretched out onto that bottom rope. I think that's the only thing that saved him, John. I believe so too, now Sheridan's looking to finish him. He has to go for the finish here. That's, he said, we got a kill scream coming up. Oh, my God. How old school is that? This ain't Dig Dug. This ain't Donkey Kong. This ain't Duck Hunt. Oh, what a counter. Wow. Sean Sheridan did not see that coming. Nice Abisco bridge there from Blaze. Wow. Him out with a clothesline. Oh. Another one. Oh, he missed that kick, though. He didn't miss that. Wow. <laughs> Tornado kick from Blaze. A little lackadaisical Ooh. on the cover for Draven Blaze. Only oh, got two. A little cocky there, Mr. Blaze. A little too cocky. That he's, super kick's put them all out. He's waiting for that super kick. He hit it. Oh, solidly, too. What a super kick from Draven Blaze. Oh, another really cocky cover there, Blaze. 
I think that I think he he might be looking to do that though. The Dra the Draven Blaze, the Jaded Angel. He's oh, no. quite jaded. Oh no! Oh no! Three and a quarter splash off the top. No, no! Draven gets crotched on that top rope. Oh, Sheridan looking for the backpack. Sheridan could be looking for that. No! Cut the Hajime! Oh, he got it locked in, John. Wrong move by Sean Sheridan. He's got it locked in. Oh, he tapped. Oh, he got the he cut. tapped. That's it. He tapped out. Cut the Hajime clutch. That was quick. He's like a snake. That's how quickly he put that on. Sean Sheridan went for the backpack off the middle rope. Blaze counter to the cut the Hajime. Hooked him in a clutch. Immediate tap out. What it's saying, he tapped out. He absolutely did. All our great fans here at On Fire Wrestling Audience here in Elmwood Park. Big submission win by the Jaded Angel and the extreme part of Jim Thorpe, Pennsylvania.